And our soccer correspondent, Tony O'Donoghue, joins us now from Walkinstown. My goodness, Tony, hard to believe so much time has passed by since those iconic images at the Walkinstown roundabout during Italian 90. How have the community been paying respects to Big Jack today? There was a lovely warmth here at Walkers. And as you say, 1990, the famous scenes when Ireland won that penalty shootout, this place was absolutely thronged with people and celebration. And it was a bit like that again today, because even on the day that Jack Charlton was laid to rest, he was still bringing joy to the Irish people, as he had done in the past. There was a, an impeccably observed minute silence, apart from the car horns who weren't aware of that going around the roundabout. A wreath was laid, and then the famous Put Him Under Pressure song was played as well. And everyone danced and sang and remember the good times that Jack Charlton brought to Ireland. So even though it's a sad day, it was also a celebration of the magic that Jack Charlton brought to Irish life. Very, very sad day. But we as a nation and as Irish people, we had such fond memories of Jack. It was an, it's an honour to have that man as, as manager of Ireland. He gave all the Irish people a great boost to their spirit and we're still buzzing from it. You know, you'd wonder what Big Jack himself would think of all that. He often used to wonder, especially when Ireland celebrated not winning anything, uh, he once said that we were as mad as a box of frogs, but he was also a real father figure to the nation as well. And I'd say he would have enjoyed this. And certainly I'm sure the scenes here and around the country will be a source of comfort to the Charlton family. Yes, indeed, wonderful scenes on such a sad occasion. Tony, thank you.